Hi there, and welcome back for more Explore Tulsa. Now, Stevie, have you ever stayed at a bed and breakfast? Well, I actually have both of those at home. I have a bed, and although I'm not really much of a breakfast person, if unless you count, of course, a Pop-Tart and Diet Dr. Oh Pepper. Oh my, we really need to do something about your diet. <laughs> but most people find a bed and breakfast to be relaxing, fun, and a great getaway. If only we could find such a place. Oh, we already have, and it's right here in Tulsa at the Cedar Rock Inn. It's just an old, cool old house, and the man that I bought it from, he was the one that said it should be a bed and breakfast. So, you know, being really naive, or like, okay, buy it, you know, and that was, you know, seven bathrooms to restore and, you know, put in, and we added a dining room on the end of it. So, um, I'm kind of a hospitality girl anyway. I love to entertain and have company. So that's what a bed and breakfast is, is everything that you go away for. obviously had um, construction people, but like I said, it was seven years, so we became really good friends with all these people, and they were as much as a, an artist, I would say. You know, every floor that was, re, was put down, you know, they put the right wood where you would walk in and you'd see the, you know, design of the wood. All the furniture is completely hand-picked, and, you know, seven years we touched every inch of this and tried to keep the integrity of the, the age of it to um, make it a really special place, and, but updated it, you know, with the new electric, new plumbing and all that type of stuff. But it really is a magical place. I mean, it's just a quiet, peaceful, romantic, the whole thing, you know, all wrapped up in one. The Honeymoon Suite has a, we call it the park view. It actually looks out over a little park that we have and um, jacuzzi bathtub and all that kind of stuff. And then um, this room is um, the Cedar Suite and it's got a cedar sauna in it um, that we added. And uh, the bed's all cedar and the walls are all cedar. So it's, it's just unique, each room is just something that, and some of our guests, that's what they say, we're going to come and stay at every room. So they make a point of going to, you know, make, booking different rooms. You know, the silo, it's two properties over, so that it all sits on the same acreage, so you can stay at Cedar Rock while, you, you know, there isn't events over next door. But the silo is a event center, so you can do any type of events. Of course, weddings are a major business. And it's just a really nice venue. I mean, different than anything else that you probably is in Tulsa. And, um, and I'm proud of that. I actually, we built that structure from an old barn. So the barn sits in the middle, or in the structure itself, but it's all new with a silo. I feel really blessed that I get to live here and I feel blessed that I get to offer some wonderful place for people to come and stay and you know refresh their their romance or their you know their relationships in a really nice quiet way and I'm really very proud of it I mean it's a nice beautiful place in Tulsa and I feel like it's a beautiful place in the world <laughs> you know that's why I tell my staff we're not only just Oklahoma we serve the whole world. And uh, so I just, you know, it's a little hidden gem out here, but we're becoming, you know, people are beginning to know us and come back. And um, so to me, it's, you know, it's just, I'm proud of it. <laughs>